Hello, my friends, and welcome back to Terra and Victor. I will help them. Switch off your intense. brains for another 45 minutes <laughs> as we wait for research to complete. I really feel like this could have been a turn based game, you know. I really do. Hmm, I might need that control point capacity. I'm going to keep on stealing chunks of Europe. I don't know if this technology unlocks other technology. No idea. No idea what to research. In terms of drives, this says it's slightly better than the ion drive, and the ion drive seems We're to be the best their and minds. drive that I have Public right now. Opinion is moving in our direction. Public sentiment is increasingly with us. Come on, 28% chance. Give me a little slice of that you pie. Oh, 22. Our enemies are still in control. They all crack down. If I had a top of the line investigator, I could do a crackdown. I forgot all about the Caribbean states. Aren't they, uh, uh, they're not federated, are they? I'm here. Acknowledged. Head into the capital. Let's go and federate them. Colloid Drive. Is complete. Does it in any way help me unlock anything? I feel like it doesn't.
Let's grab the instruments of soft power just for the control tech. Hydroponics. Reduces Habs, volatiles, and water consumption by the equivalent amount consumed by 50 crew. Okay, there's actually spare power on this. Which I guess is fine. Let's just switch that off. Now it says minus 10. Uh, yeah, this is not necessary. Science Research Center. Oh, the farm is the upgraded version of the hydroponics.
Total potential power consumption 177. Total potential power available 220. So that's fine. This is another one that seems overpowered, but it isn't. Uh, if you were to turn off the reactor you're left with very little power to do anything with offering assistance okay I made a few changes to try and stop losing combustibles I don't even have a single ship and uh... I don't even have a single ship and I don't have the resources. New Navy US has gained the freedom of the We've sea. Moved the needle. Our case remains unhurt. Our cause is unjustified to them. Mission complete. Better right. Enemies suffer minus four on control space asset. Plus two to inspire. It's alright. Okay. Grab the Social Science Research Center. Which one did I build hydroponics? Build a farm instead. Oh, 
I'll turn that back on because it will be needed when the time comes. The opposition remains in power. Man, how many aliens are there? Man, the game is lagging, there's so many. That's a lot. Wow, 8,000 attack power in that one fleet. Forty seven ships. Yeah, it remains the case that each individual ship has got about a hundred combat rating between 100 and 200 and these are corvettes and frigates they're not even big ships you gotta be launching like really powerful ships to even have a hope. Look at all these fleets. Okay, wow. We're going in. Well. My what is there? I mean, what is there to even say? <laughs> the amount of ships up there is ridiculous. There's no way it can go into space. Believe and accept that there are other souls out there, created by the divine, as we ourselves were. It is okay. What's the next technology? Fusion. Public opinion is moving in our direction. Public opinion remains unmoved. The people will come to our side. Let's try this maximum effort thing and see how expensive it truly gets. By the numbers. We are in control now. 
Yes. Oh, yes. I got me a little slice of the EU pie. gonna be so they're 20 each 80 100 I don't necessarily think I can get the whole EU but Going in hot. Acknowledged. Terminating the opposition. Now I have a control point. Gaining more will be easy. Or easier. Offering counsel. If I have to abandon nations to get the EU, I will. Uh, well. For want of better things to research, away we go. We're winning their hearts and minds. Public sentiment is increasingly with us. Public opinion is moving in our direction. Hmm, I've only got a 24% chance now. Interestingly. Get these modules researched. Target destroyed. We've removed some threats. Oh, I got it. Another little slice of the EU is mine. The US has actually got quite a lot of armies. I'm gonna ease off on the armies.
targeting the opposition. Where do you need me? Uh, wait a minute. Can you federate now? I think I need executive control of the EU to actually make that succeed. Securing our control. Forever at war with the aliens. Offering support. Making things safe for our people. Urban armoring. Megafauna does 50% less damage to our regions. Population loss and GDP damage by nuclear strikes reduced. It's alright. Gonna be expensive though, isn't it? Hmm, I don't actually see it anywhere. There it is. Okay. What does this technology do or unlock? Good question. The people will come to our side. We hold no sway in their minds. We've moved the needle. Man, the U.S. is being attacked quite heavily. I still think it's too enormous for anyone to succeed at any kind of public campaign there. Our associates there. were unable to take control. But hey. We are unable to take control. Let's, um... Anyone load up? Twenty-two. Let's help her to move the needle. More engineering.
Hmm. Five percent economy and a load of cash. But I've actually become quite wealthy. Anything to further speed up the acquisition of technology in this long and somewhat painful process. Gear up. Lending my expertise. Okay. The European Union is nearly done building an army. Another one. What I really need is to add navies to my US armies so that they can get around. Public sentiment is increasingly with us. And so that and they provide blockade to our site. blockade factor. Public opinion is moving in our direction. Plus three on steel, plus three on sabotage, yeah. Hmm. What's that? Commercial mining companies. Oh yeah, forgot about that. Score one for the good guys. The aliens keep building up in space, and I just keep on building up on Earth. And I almost feel like the Earth will be unified before we actually get anywhere, truly. The opposition remains in power. Keep at it. Taking it to them. I will drop other nations to keep the whole of the EU. Man, this has become a great nation. <laughs> not very, uh, not very bright, but uh, offering assistance. Quietly contributing to my cause since the very beginning of the game.
Should I just get this and start the South American Union project? Unifying countries together to resist the aliens. Oh, I'm not allowed to do anything. We've moved the needle. We've moved the needle. We're winning their hearts and minds. Man, that cohesion loss really hurts. The LC is secure. Oh, they're bombarding the US again. Our associates are now in charge. Nice. Just a couple more hits on the EU. Standing by for orders. We're taking power. Purge, purge, purge. This is very expensive going. But it'll be worth it. Reporting in. Securing our interests. I will help them. Making things safe for our people. Okay. Breakup of Brazil. Territorial Defense Battalions, another 5% military bonus. How expensive Public is it? Public opinion is moving in our direction. Oh, it's cheaper. Public sentiment is increasingly with us. Our cause is unjustified to them. It's cheaper than the drones. Even though it does the same thing. More or less. I think it does. Or is one one's military and one's build army? We're in control here. <sighs> Just one more hit and the executive is mine.
they hit the Nordic Federation. That is part of my key that is a key part of my future consolidation efforts. This guy is just here non-stop. Securing our control. Ready for my mission. Let's hope he doesn't get the last point there. Because if he takes that, I won't be able to unify them, which will be very, very annoying. I'm going to need less CP to control all this if I start unifying, so... Offering counsel. Protecting our interests. Those farms have reduced my volatiles usage quite a bit. The people will come to our side. Still not great though. The people will come to our side. We're winning their hearts and minds. Oh, I'm so close to unifying all of this. You can almost taste it. This was an unexpected move, but I can deal with it. Our enemies are still in control. 82% chance. Ah. Now we must once again wait. What's the op? She's also got purge, but she sucks at it. Removing our enemies. Your orders? He will now be able to equip a new organization in the near future.
Let's move the needle. One for five is amazing. Two for five, it's okay. Two for three is not so great. So she's got nine, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, five, nine. That can go. science. Social science. I do have a social science project going right now. Making things safe for our people. Lending my expertise. Okay. Securing our interests. Come on, let me win these. I got a humanity to unify. Unify it, I shall. We've moved the needle. The people will come to our side. Truly. I would love to believe that we will comport ourselves better on other worlds than we do here, but I am not naive. There will, I am afraid, be blood. Director Khalid Olashgar, Classified Project Exodus Security Briefing. Nice. Community policing drones. Aliens just suffer. <laughs> Aliens just suffer horribly. Clean up the debris. Do it. There's too much alien control there. We are in control now. Yes. The European Union is mine. It's time for merging. Unable to take control. Let's plan the next turn carefully. It's our old friend. Your orders? Though we're doing too much, Amatron. We're taking power. 
Go ahead and purge him, please. Standing by. I'm here. Securing our interests. Ready to go. Where to? Heading to the capital. Acknowledged. Heading to the LC. It's time! We finally made it. It's time to start merging all of this into one giant cohesive blob. It's going to be an enormous undertaking, but when it is complete, all of Europe and all of North America will be unified. And we can worry about South America as our next project. This will be ridiculously hard for the aliens to do anything about. Truly. They can stay stuck on Australia forever as far as I'm concerned. If I keep building navies, they might not ever be able to get off. Um. Ready for orders. Time to make our move. We'll ask, we'll get Norway to ask to join. Germany is not Germany is not in the uh, not in the EU bizarrely Right, I'm not sure how I unify all this mess, but there must be a way. Okay, I'm going to say that that is it for now, but soon I should be able to unify all of this.
The question is how. I think we'll ask we'll ask Norway to join the the EU. Or do I ask the US to join the EU? Is that how you do it? Ireland. Hmm. I, I keep on saying that's it for now, and then I realize there's a couple of things I need to do while I'm thinking about it. Must be in the same federation. Okay, I can merge the EU with the Nordic Federation. Enough, maybe I have to leave the North American Federation and then federate the UK in. I'm sure I'm sure I can figure it out. Once I have full control of the EU. Norway can join the Nordic Federation. And then, uh, and then merge in.
Just gotta merge it all together. It's just gonna take time and thought. For some reason, Germany is not part of the EU, which is mind boggling. But we'll fix that as well. And when this grand project is complete, I'll I'll work on this region too. The acquisition of all these militaries is uh although it doesn't look like they have Unfortunately, they do not have naval capability. So they're defensive only. Anyway, that's it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed it. See you guys next time.